Hello dear friend. Welcome back to my channel and another video about Squarespace. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create a YouTube style feed on your Squarespace website. So most of us are familiar with embedding videos into blog posts just like this, and it works really great. But if you are not really blogging, or you don't want to commit to adding all the text and all the different elements, you just want an individual page on your website to display all your YouTube videos. This is perfect for you. At the end of this video, you can make YouTube feed like this on your Squarespace website. So, let's begin. First, we have to go to the Squarespace website dashboard page that we already have. Then, select the Pages button. Select the Not Link menu. Click the Add button. Choose Blank Page. Change the name to YouTube. After that, a new page will appear, so we can edit the YouTube feed. Click Edit. Then add sections. Click Add a blank section. A new section will appear for editing. To bring up the grid, press the G key on the keyboard. Then we can add session contents by clicking add block. Select videos. Click add videos. Click add form link. Enter the YouTube link you want to input. As an example, I will add my YouTube video link. Copy video link. The video will be embedded. In the description, we can add a YouTube video title. After that, drag and drop the video to the center. Then duplicate the video to the left and right. Duplicate all videos into two rows. Set according to need. Once it's set, we can edit video links and video titles by adding other videos on my YouTube. This is a display of all the YouTube videos that we have entered. Next, we can add a section title.
Also section description. Edit according to your wish. Then add a button to go to our YouTube account. Add an access link to our YouTube account. Edit as desired. The following is a display of the YouTube feed on the Squarespace website. For mobile view, we need to customize video layout. so that it becomes more organized. We can also change the appearance of the background section by adding a texture, picture, or color, as you wish. After everything is as you wish, press the save button to save changes. Then press exit to return to the setting page menu. Next, we can move YouTube navigation to the main navigation. So that on the navigation bar menu, the YouTube menu will appear. Finally. Our YouTube feed has been created successfully. And this is the display. Ok my friend, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to get more information about Blogger. See you on next video.